Hi, I'm Terry. And I'm Taylor. And this is Bird R.Y. <laughs> Did you want to do that together? I thought you said we weren't doing that though. Okay. And this is Bird R.Y. This is Bird R.Y. Okay. Alright. So, we have six episodes lined up for you. This first episode, we're going to focus on the do's and don'ts of birding. Because we know some of you might not get the birding thing down that well. That doesn't make, that make sense. Yeah, it does make sense. Yeah. And I think it's important that we bird ethically. Ethically. It's very important. So, we're going to show you a few tips, tricks, the do's and don'ts, and maybe like the correct shoes to wear, the types of sounds you make. Now you're just giving it away. Oh, sorry. Anyway, you get the gist of it. So this is what this first episode is going to be about. Yeah, that was cool. What's that bird over there? Where? It's so loud. Shh. Look. These crested ringlets. Turn them up. I'm not going to take so long to get all the things off. Okay. Should we go round or should we go directly straight? I think they've seen us. They're frozen. Do you think if we stay frozen, it will help? Maybe. I've never stalked a bird before. I not either, actually. Let's just do it. Supposed to catch them. I can't see them, Taylor. Terry, can you hear that? What's that? Is that a gorgeous bush rock? We're in a river. Oh my gosh, oh my so. Gosh. Oh, that's gonna be gorge. Should we try and get closer? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's just go down. Oh! 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 Are you okay? I told you to wear shoes! I forgot! Sorry. At this rate, we're not going to see any birds. I actually don't even know why I'm here. Taylor? Yes? You know what twitches are? I think so. The people who are like crazy about birds. They go, oh, oh, yeah. they get on a plane and fly across the world to see one specific bird. Yes. I, I mean, have. I love birds, okay. but I mean, I don't know if I love them that much. Yeah, no, not me. But apparently there's this new thing called bricking. Bricking? Can I show you? Please show me. Oh, that looks quite easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what you do, you just throw a whole lot of bricks, in our case stones, and you wait for the birds to come out. Watch. Got one! I got one. Black bear popped back. You mean you got one as in you killed one? Then why would you throw rocks at them though if you're not gonna kill them? I don't know, I didn't come up with the concept. Are you playing that on your phone? Yeah. You're not allowed to do that. Well, how else are we gonna get the birds to come here? No, you're just gonna mess up the territorial displays and their mating habits. I mean, it's just the worst thing to do. Oh, okay, well then I, I won't be. I didn't know that. Don't call the birds. It's bad birding etiquette. We wait for the birds. Okay. Well, but my mum always told me I need to practice patience. Well, here's your chance. See anything yet? No, not yet. I, what happens if I play the song one no, more no, no, time? No, 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 no. One more time. <sighs> okay, just play one more time. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, yeah. They don't sound like that though. They sound like a uh, Tarzan. Yeah, but no. No, it's okay. So it's really important when you're out birding to stay hydrated, but also to remain quiet because you normally sit out in areas for a long time. We've been sitting here for quite a while, for quite a while. I still haven't seen this bird. African green pigeon. It's eluding us. Anyway. Legit just said, stay hydrated and Okay, we'll work on those listening skills. It's okay. There it is. There is it. Wow, oh, it's so beautiful. Uh, there wasn't anything. What is, uh, is that a leaf again? These leaves. Not me. <laughs> they must just leave us alone. Leave us alone. <laughs>
<laughs> you a good one. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Now, if I'm looking for the barbet, it seems like it might be really far away. <laughs> um, Terry, I think that's because you're using your binoculars the wrong way around. Maybe switch them? Yeah. So that goes that way. Now try it. Oh, you're a bit tangled there. No, tangled okay. Terry. Oh, that's much better. Yeah, you're still struggling. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> it happens to the best of us. Yeah. You know, I can't wait to see. Do they hang from the trees like this? No, your bird box upside down. No, oh, it's much better. <laughs> now I know what I'm looking for. Yeah. You know. <laughs> what a team we make. Yep. While birding. Yes. We've seen it takes quite a while for the birds to sometimes appear. I think that's mainly because we make so much noise. Probably. Mm. But while you wait for the birds, there are some really fun things you can do. Like sandcastles. Yeah, well, I'm going to make a better sandcastle than you though. You don't know how competitive I am. Can we use the water? No, it's got rehydrating. I ah. need to drink that. Okay. It's quite hard to do it without water. Well, you know, that's where you've got to be creative. Ta-da! My flag's bigger than yours. Oh, okay. <laughs> so you put it in your mouth. Okay, where's the line? Okay. Hey. Do I stand on the You don't even oh. told everyone okay. oh, what Oh, sorry. Oh my gosh, how can I be so da- blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Ah. How can I be so silly? We've got to tell people what we're doing. This is called, this is called a bok troliki in English. It's just a, uh, a an antelope poop. Yep. But there's a game you can play with it. What's the game called? Bok troll spuch. Have you got one in your mouth while you said that? This is part of my technique. Take oh. note, if you want to do really well in bok troll spuch, you keep it in your mouth for a really long time. And you just, you let that box draw. <laughs> that sounds really <laughs> gross. The antelope poo. Whatever. Poo yeah. in South Africa. Poop. If you're in everywhere else in the world. You sit, sit there for a while. Just keep it in the side of your cheek. You know, have a little cheek pouch, like maybe a squirrel or something. A squirrel for a few pouches? I think they do. Hamsters. Hamster. Anyways, keep it in your mouth for as long as you can. And then, you got to shoot the poop. Which one? Should I have a big one or a small one? Well, I, you don't want to choke. Okay, so maybe like a medium sized one. Yeah. And okay. I can put it in my mouth. Are you ready to be embarrassed? I've got goosebumps. Oh, you'll be fine. Okay, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Oh, you're so brave. Now, you don't go past the line, otherwise you get disqualified. Very like strict. Okay. Yeah, like that. And then you're going to spuch or spit it as far as you can. Okay. Okay. That was possibly the worst. <laughs> I just wanted to get it out of my mouth. Okay, let me show you how it's really done. <clears throat> Go ahead. <laughs> Remove all the excess saliva. Are you ready? Get your binoculars okay. out. It's okay. going to go that okay. far. Okay, okay, okay. okay. <sighs> there. Yes! Wow. <laughs> that looks so good! Oh, so I'm amazing at Bok Trolls Book! Please tell <laughs> everybody how good I am at Bok Trolls Book because no one believes me! Thank you so much for watching the second episode of Bird Awa with Terry and Taylor. If you like this video and you want to see more of our faces and how to bird, please subscribe to our channel and you will get weekly updates on when our videos will be up. Click the subscribe button. It's up here. Yeah, there. Somewhere. Up top. Maybe a bit lower. Lower. Okay. I don't know how big the screen is. It's up there. Okay. <laughs>